Hi, good day everyone. Welcome to the first HBL video uh, for the Primary 5. Okay, so today we are going to do a simple activity where you just need a few pair of socks and this will roughly take you about half an hour to complete. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so basically what you need is uh, one pair of socks or you might want to have another pair standby to make this uh, item bounce here. So what you do is, you just have to combine all the four socks together Okay And make it into a ball Alright, so you roll it from the top Alright, and then The outermost socks, you just have to open it up And stuff all the rest of the socks in And this is the ball that you will do for your next half an hour Alright, so now that you have the ball ready, uh, let's start. But before that, please take note of these guidelines that you have to follow before you actually begin this exercise. For the warm up, okay, this is what you're going to do. Hold the ball with your right hand and just have to toss it in the air slightly above your head level and catch it with your right hand okay so do it 10 times 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 next shift it to the left hand and then repeat the same thing for 10 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8, 9, 10 That's part 1 Part 2 of the warm up is You transfer the ball from your right hand to the left hand By ensuring the ball move in a rainbow shape Okay, again the ball should not go above your head level This way Back to the right The left The right 10 times 1 2 3 4 5 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Alright? Part 3 of the warm up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright, so once you have done the warm up, let's go on to the main activity. Okay, you need a wall in front of you so that this thing can work and you need of course the ball sock that you just made earlier on. Okay, so what you do is you go to the wall, right, as close as possible, and then take one large step back. Okay, right, make sure your legs are should I go back. What you're going to do is you're going to throw the ball using the underhand method, using your right hand first. Let the ball bounce back off the wall and then catch it with your right, uh, left hand. Okay, and then repeat the same thing now. Use your left hand to throw the ball underhand method. Let the ball bounce off the wall and catch it with your right hand. Okay, we do for one minute and then we try to see how many times you can catch a ball without the ball dropping to the floor. If the ball drops to the floor, your count will start from zero again. Alright, ready? Let's try. One, two,
the ball can be caught easier if you throw it at eye level. Alright? So you have to experiment it and try out for a few times before you can actually find out the best method for you. Okay? So this exercise is to train your hand-eye coordination skills. It's very important for you to have very good hand-eye coordination skills if you want to play games such as badminton, mini tennis, volleyball or all the other net barrel games because what you need to do is in these games you need to move alright and hit the ball back which might come to you at a very fast speed so with good hand-eye connection skills you are able to play these games better yeah so what I just showed you just now is a very good training to make sure that you have a very good way to train up your hand-eye connection skills okay yeah so again it's a very simple activity you may do this, do this anytime that you want and train up as much as you can during this HBR period. Okay, that's all for me. Thank you very much.